Sea lions. Sea lions are sea mammals that usually live in waters ranging from subarctic to tropical seas worldwide, excluding the northern Atlantic Ocean. On average, they typically measure 8 feet in length and weigh up to 650 pounds. They are carnivorous and usually eat fish such as herring, mackerel, salmon, and other species, depending on where they live. Sea lions are not typically dangerous for humans, but they may attack if they feel threatened. These mammals are highly intelligent and easy to train, so much that they are common zoo and circus animals. Galapagos sea lions are often compared to dogs for their friendly behavior. These sea lions don't usually flee when encountering humans. In fact, they even like to approach people and sometimes hop on boats or kayaks as they love to be pet. However, this is not the case in all regions and most places recommend tourists keep a minimum distance of 8 feet. Although sea lion attacks are usually rare, some species may be unpredictable. Sometimes human presence and human activities may cause them to engage in violent actions. Recently, in May of 2017, a young girl was snatched by a California sea lion while sitting on the edge of a dock on a Canadian port. The girl was immediately saved by a woman who jumped into the water to rescue her. Authorities claimed that the young girl's parents were to blame for the incident, for having let her sit so close to the edge. Although there were multiple signs displayed on the dock for people to not feed the sea animals, the footage recorded by people nearby showed the sea lion eating food tossed into the water before going after the girl. Number 6. Humpback Whales Humpback whales are one of the largest species of baleen whales. Adults can measure over 50 feet in length and can weigh up to 80 tons. They live in all major oceans and seas around the world and can migrate up to 16,000 miles each year. Humpback whales feed on small schooling fish like salmon, herring, and capelin. They hunt by direct attacks or by hitting the water with their pectoral fins and stunning their prey. They are known for surface behaviors such as breaching and even leaping out of the water, making them popular with whale watchers. Humpback whales are curious about nearby objects and typically approach whale watching boats closely. They are usually peaceful and don't pose threats to humans, so there are many diving tours around the world that allow people to swim alongside humpback whales. The humpback whale is currently listed as an endangered species. It is estimated that 90% of the population was was eliminated during the whaling era and the species is now protected against hunting by law. Number 5. Sea Turtles. Sea Turtles also known as marine turtles, can be found in most oceans of the world, excluding polar regions. They are omnivorous and feed with a wide variety of plant and animal life, including seaweed, sponges, mollusks, worms, and fish. Some species are only omnivorous in their juvenile stage and become completely herbivorous as they mature. Sea turtles are usually friendly to swimmers and might even swim right up to them as they encounter them in the water. However, people are usually instructed not to disturb them and to give them plenty of space when they venture onto the beach, as that is when they lay their eggs and it is very important for them not to be interrupted. Three species of sea turtles are currently classified as endangered or critically endangered, and another three species are considered vulnerable. Although they are friendly to humans, our species are a real threat to them, as beach towns used to profit by selling their meat. In in an attempt to promote ecotourism as a substitute to sea turtle hunting, the Caribbean Conservation Corporation made their nesting grounds sustainable by turning them into tourist attractions. Thousands of tourists annually visit the conservation located in Costa Rica, a 22-mile protected beach that hosts turtle walks and nesting grounds. Number 4. Porpoises Porpoises are a group of fully aquatic marine mammals. Along with dolphins and whales, they are descendants of land-living ungulates that first entered the ocean around 50 million years ago. Their size ranges from 4.5 to 7.5 feet long and can weigh anywhere from 120 to 500 pounds. Porpoises are usually found near polar regions, often close to the coast. They feed mostly on fish and squid, and similar to dolphins, they communicate 
by producing a variety of clicks and whistles. In relation to humans, they tend to be very friendly. They are usually not frightened by swimmers and have been observed protecting stranded humans from sharks. A popular instance of a porpoise-human interaction is that of Mary Poppins star who rescued one of these animals. In November 2010, Dick Van Dyke reportedly fell on his surfboard and woke up out of sight of land, as he later declared. He was then saved by a pod of porpoises that pushed him to shore. A similar case of porpoises saving a man lost at sea was registered in September of 2014. Joey Trevino spent over 30 hours stranded adrift after the boat he was fishing in, along with three other friends, started taking on water. Trevino, who was wearing a life vest, was soon separated with the others, and after spending hours waiting for help, he almost lost hope. He was thinking of removing his vest, but regained his will to fight fight for his life when a porpoise arrived and lingered around until a tanker passed close enough to hear his calls. Soon, a helicopter was dispatched to airlift him to safety after 31 hours of this ordeal. Number 3. Manatees Manatees are large marine mammals that can measure up to 13 feet long and weigh up to 1,300 pounds. Despite being so big, they are mostly herbivorous and eat over 60 different freshwater and saltwater plants. They are considered to be very intelligent animals, and their task learning abilities are similar to dolphins. They are known to be gentle giants and also nicknamed sea cows for their large size and friendly disposition. They do not pose a serious threat to humans and are even frightened when encountered with our species in the water. However, by approaching them carefully, some swimmers have had the opportunity to swim alongside them. These animals are usually found in warm waters on the Gulf Coast and have been seen all the way up to the coast of New England. There are only three species of manatees, and all of them have been listed by the World Conservation Union as vulnerable to extinction. Approximately 99 manatees die each year because of human activities. Large vessels like ships and tugboats are very dangerous for them, and many individuals have died after being injured by the vessels. After the cuts lead to fatal infections. They are often unable to hear ships approaching as many large boats emit very low frequencies while manatees only hear high frequencies. While not all manatees that encounter ships are killed, most are injured and suffer major tail mutilations and multiple disfiguring dorsal lacerations. Additional threats for manatees are red tides, the proliferated and microscopic marine algae which produces toxic toxins that attack their nervous system, and fishing gear which they accidentally ingest while feeding. Number 2. Whale Sharks the whale shark is one of the friendliest shark species when it comes to interacting with humans. They have over 3,000 teeth, but they are filter feeding fish, so they do not eat using their teeth. Although their mouths can be as large as 5 feet in diameter, whale sharks only feed on plankton, small fish, and squid because their throats are the size of a quarter. Therefore, they do not pose significant danger to humans. They are very docile creatures and have been known for allowing swimmers to hold on for a ride, and there are many photos and videos on the internet of people swimming alongside whale sharks. They are impressive in size, usually measuring about 32 feet in length and weigh approximately 20,000 pounds. Whale sharks are the largest non-cetaceous animal in the world. Despite being so large, divers don't usually fear them and might seek them for a unique experience of getting to swim with one. Catching a ride with these animals is a popular popular tourist attraction in Cancun. Although they are not known to be a threat to humans, scientists warn swimmers to be careful around them and not provoke them with too much physical contact. When swimming with whale sharks in Cancun, tourists may not touch them and must always maintain at least a 6 foot distance from their head and a 13 foot distance from their tail. Whale sharks live in areas ranging from Bay Islands in Honduras to the Galapagos Islands islands to the Horn of Africa. However, they are most popular in Cancun because that is where the largest congregation of whale sharks in the world has been witnessed. Number 1. Dolphins 
Dolphins are known for their special relationship with humans. They are very curious animals, and they are not usually afraid of our species. There have been numerous reports of dolphins saving humans from being attacked by sharks or even drowning. Even in history and religion, these mammals have played an important role. For example, Greek mythology has described them as helpers of mankind. In ancient times, Greeks considered that spotting dolphins riding in a ship wake to be a good omen. They live in most oceans of the world, and scientists discovered that these mammals are capable of grieving and know how to teach, learn, cooperate, and even scheme. Their brains are home to elongated spindle neurons, cells which in humans are evolved to social conduct, judgment, emotions, and theory of mind. Dolphins are highly self-aware, which is seen by some as a sign of development and abstract thinking. They were first tested in 1990 by K. Martin and S. Saracos. The researchers showed a group of dolphins real-time footage of themselves on television. They were expected to show social behavior, but instead showed signs of self-awareness. Dolphins also passed the mirror test, which involves placing some temporary dye on the animal's body, and then the animals presented with the mirror to see that it shows signs of self-recognition. Dolphins' behavior also display culture, something that is believed to be unique to humans. Mothers pass on their daughters a learned tradition of covering their snouts with sponges to protect them from foraging. Another learned habit was discovered among river dolphins in Brazil. Some of the male members of the group were found to use weeds and sticks as part of their sexual display. Dolphins are highly social and often regarded as the Earth's most intelligent animal when compared to other species.